Hi everybody! In this video I will explain sitemaps. A sitemap is a diagram of the high-level structure of a website. It shows the different categories of content, but it also shows the structure of a website. The high-level structure. Well, let's try and draw one. You usually start with drawing the home page. Then you draw some main pages that are on the next level of the website. Let's call them A, B, C and D. These main pages usually also have some more sub pages on a different level. As you can see this whole structure looks a little bit like a tree structure. Also, a sitemap is a way to determine how many levels there are in a website. If there are too many levels, it will be impossible to search and navigate the website in a user-friendly way. Well, if you see a sitemap, you probably wonder how this will compare to the pages of a website. Well, if you have a home page, you probably have a menu on the top with the different pages with A, B, C and D. They are usually also buttons that you can click on to navigate to these pages. Maybe there's a picture, maybe there is some text. And if you click on A, which is here in the sitemap, you go to a different page to page A. Well, on this page you probably have a sub menu which will lead you also to another page again. These pages you can see here in the website. To sum it up, a sitemap is a flexible way to visualize the structure of a website and it also shows the different categories of the content of the website. There are no details on a sitemap, you only see a high level visualization. It's impossible to really draw every single page of a website in a sitemap. Then it will become chaotic and you will miss the sort of clear overview of the structure. A well designed structure is really indispensable for a user friendly website. And also in the stuff around us, you can see why structure is so important. If you consider, for example, the leaves of a tree as the interface of a tree, and you consider the branches as the structure of a tree, you can imagine what will happen if you take the structure away. If you do this, you will end up just with a pile of formless leaves on the ground. The structure is gone, the shape is gone. If you take the structure out of a building, this will happen. So remember, a website needs a well-designed structure to guarantee a user-friendly interaction. Thank you for tuning in and speak to you later.